Hey everybody, this video brings us out to Florida. We have made it, I have made it. Me, me and Vanabelle have made it to Florida. I am pretty excited about this. <coughs> it's the first time I have talked today. My voice is still not quite with me yet, but we're actually here right on the border of Florida and Georgia. Came right over the, uh, the little bridge there and now I'm here at the Welcome Center. Pretty excited about this. There's actually something I wanna show you guys, something you can do when you come to Florida. If you're ever coming into Florida, I'm not sure if this is at every single welcome center, but definitely the one here right on, right on 95. Interstate, interstate, route, route 95, 95. The highway road 95 right there. If you're coming down 95, which is kind of probably the most, I'd say common way to come into Florida if you're coming from the north. You can stop here at the Welcome Center and actually do something pretty cool that I've only done once before because usually when I get here, it's very, very, very late at night. I'd say 95% of the time I get to the Welcome Center, it's like 10, 11, 12, 3, 4, 5 o'clock in the morning. Like, it is crazy, ridiculously late usually when I get out of here. But right now, it's like 9 o'clock in the morning. They're open and there's something I want to show you guys. So, drove all yesterday. Yesterday was insane. It was intense how much driving I actually did. I I bunkered, I, I just, I bunkered down and I drove as far as I possibly could. Then got up bright and early this morning, drove some more, and now I'm here at the Welcome Center very early in the morning. It's easy, Florida Showcase, look at that. These big Florida Showcase signs up. There's all kinds of things here about wildlife as well. Animal tracks, great blue heron. I see those all the time down here. Wild turkeys, that, that's awesome. Gray fox, white-tailed deer. This is the uh, the uh, state mammal of Pennsylvania, actually. Out, of course, they have American alligators and, um, ooh, the river otter. I've seen one of those here as well. I remember I was driving past a, oh, there's the, there's the tracks. That's pretty awesome. I was driving past a, um, a lake a couple years ago down here in Florida, and I'm, I'm noticing there's something swimming around. I stopped and pulled over, and it was a river otter swimming around this lake. It was pretty awesome. There's all the different tracks, what they look like. So if you see any of these tracks, you now know what animal they belong to. Oh, we're, we're not done yet. There's also a Florida panther. I've never seen one of those in a while, thankfully. That'd be scary to come across a panther. But there's the, look at the, look at, look at, seriously, look at the size of the, the paws. They're almost as big as my hand. That'd be terrifying. And a black bear. I'd honestly rather come across a black bear probably than a panther. Do you, do you know which one's more dangerous? Is a, is a Florida panther more dangerous than a black bear? Or is a black bear more dangerous than a panther? I have no idea. By the way, the, the, they got balloons there. I keep seeing the shadow of the balloon. I keep thinking somebody's walking up on me. Looks like somebody's like, see that? Looks like a head. As I'm filming, I'm thinking, who, who's coming up on me? It's just a shadow of the balloons. Anyway, which one's more dangerous? Comments down below, let me know. I'm thinking, I'm thinking I have a better chance with the bear than I do the panther, but I don't know, I have no idea. Anyway, so again, here in Florida, I've made it heading to Walt Disney World. So about a three or so hour drive until I actually get to Florida. So a lot of driving to do, but we're here Gonna have the welcome center. Look at that. Walt Disney World 50th anniversary. That's gonna change soon. That, that sign will come down and it will most likely be a 100th anniversary sign we'll have up soon because they're gonna ce celebrate the 100 years of the actual Walt Disney World company, which actually takes place on October 16th of this year, which I plan on being down here for in October. Look at the dolphin here with the, the musical things on it. There's, a, there's like a keyboard, a guitar. That's awesome. Clearwater Jazz, Jazz Holiday. Pretty awesome. Anyway, we're gonna go inside the Welcome Center, which I've only been into once before to partake in something that I, I have to do. Look at this. Oh, there's, they got swag. I don't know what's going on right now. Ooh. Are you lying? No. Oh no, all right, cool. Look at all this fun stuff they got here. Got sunglasses. Yeah. These Jack's buttons. Really? Wow. We have an Stickers. We have Look at that. Stickers. The arboretum, and we have a botanical garden. This is awesome. There's all kinds of cool stuff here. Got awesome. All right. So free swag. This was not what I came in here for. I didn't come in here for the free swag. But they got they got they got free swag. That's awesome. We got pens and stuff over here. Oh, they got, this is, this is always, 
That always comes in handy. Look at that, some uh, some hand sanitizer. All right, pretty awesome. Free free swag here at the um, the Welcome Center. Was not expecting that. Look at the look at this guy. I've been to the Kennedy's, Kennedy Space Center twice, but that was a long time ago. I have to go back. Sh shake his hand. Look like everybody's everybody shake shake his hand. Everybody has shook in his hand. Everybody has shake shaked his hand. Shake his hand. Go back. That's awesome. Very cool photo opportunity right there. I gotta get again. I gotta get back to the Kennedy Space Center, definitely, at some point. But all right, so. Again, I didn't really come in here for the free swag. That was just that was just a bonus. The reason why I came in here is because oh, what's right, right here at the Welcome Center. This is pretty awesome. Hello. I would, I would like some orange juice, please. I'm gonna get some free orange juice. Look at that. Thank you very much. Look at this. Little cup of free orange juice. Here's a. I don't know what this guy is. Look at this guy. Be looking at. We're in a. We're in a shunk, shunk, shunk. Oh my gosh, it's so early. A shunken trip. A sunken ship right here. Look at this. What is this for? I have no idea what this is for. This is for the Florida Treasure Coast. I have no idea. Oh, there's, there's burning treasure down there. Treasure Coast. Look at that. That's awesome. Anyway, I got my. Cool. I just walked into the superhero. What's. What's he have to do with sunk, sh shunk, shunken tre treasure? Sunken treasure. I have no idea. Anyway, all right. It's very busy in here today. It's crazy in here. <gasps> oh my gosh, look at the 15th anniversary teacup photo opportunity. That is really cool. Look at this. <laughs> that is pretty awesome. I love that they have a Disney photo opportunity inside the Welcome Center. Most people coming down here are probably heading to, actually, I don't know. I think these people are all heading towards Walt Disney World. Maybe not. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe some, I'm sure some of them are. I'm gonna say 50% of those people are heading there. Anyway, so this is what you do. You come here and you get your free cup of orange juice. The swag was, again, the swag was a bonus. I had no idea they were, they were giving out all kinds of free swag and then I grabbed some stuff. I got some sunglasses, I got some stickers, I got a, I got a pin, I got um, with the hand sanitizer. I picked up some swag, definitely. It was, it, anytime I see free swag, I'm grabbing some free swag. But the real reason why I wanted to go inside was for this right here, my free cup of OJ. I'm not a big orange juice fan. I don't really, I don't really care much for orange juice. It's just, it's too bitter, too sour. I'm not really into bitter, sour things. Not really my cup of, not my cup of orange juice. <laughs> but anyway, I always stop here when I can and get one of these. Um, they also have, I believe it's grapefruit juice in there as well. Definitely, definitely not a fan of grapefruit juice, but uh, orange juice, I can at least tolerate. So I want to stop in here and get some of this. Every time I come by here, when they are open, which is like once or twice before, that's it. I always have to get orange juice. Look at this. Should I do like a thumbnail? I don't know, there we go. Awesome. Florida, this actually says Florida grape juice on it. You got Florida grape juice. Oh no, it says Florida grape juice on one side. I'm gonna drop this. And then Florida orange juice on the other side. What's it say there? The original wellness drink. Look at that. All right, anyway, we're gonna try some of this orange juice. I've had it before. I remember it actually being pretty good. It's actually really good orange juice. I don't, again, I'm not a big fan of orange juice. I don't really care much for orange juice. I wouldn't just drink this normally, but I will say, it's actually some really good orange juice. <laughs> no pulp, if you're a fan of pulp, I'm sorry, there's no pulp in this, which is good for me, because I hate, I hate pulp. If there was pulp in this, I would've taken one swig, and I'd have been done with this, but there's no pulp, so I'm, I'm drinking the whole thing. Um, it was actually pretty good. That was. It was actually quite delicious. As somebody who doesn't like orange juice, I gotta say, that was some heck. Oh, I'm just apparently I didn't I didn't finish that. Now I'm spilling it all over my ham. Anyway, as somebody who doesn't like orange juice, that was that was a heck of an orange juice right there. That was actually pretty darn good. But all right, I'm gonna go get back in Vanderbilt now. I'm gonna head head south that way. Got three more hours of driving to go until I get to to Walt Disney World, which is my my end location. Looking forward to uh, starting my Walt Disney World vacation, which will be starting at some point today, probably. So, all right, guys. So like I said, if you're ever coming down 95 or I think any of the welcome centers, I could be wrong about that. Leave, leave, leave comments down below. Is it any welcome center or is it just this one? I, I believe it's any welcome center, or at least a couple of the welcome centers anyway. But anyway, here on 95, stop here at the Florida Welcome Center. Look at that there. They're changing trash cans. It's a very clean welcome center. Anyway, come out here. We got some photo opportunities with dolphins and, and 50th anniversary Disney World stuff and all kinds of fun things. Actually, the 50th, 50th anniversary stuff will be going going very soon. So if you want to get your photo taken with that stuff, definitely get out here and do that soon. But anyway, stop here. Get yourself some either some orange juice or some 
some grapefruit juice. It's really, really good. I definitely recommend it. But all right, like I said, I got three more hours of driving to go. I'm gonna get on that. So as always, guys, thank you so much for checking out this video. Be sure to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, check down below for links to Patreon. If you do become a patron, I will send you a postcard every single month from the road. This month's postcards will actually be coming, go, coming from Walt Disney World and going to you guys. Unfortunately, they no longer they no longer stamp them. You used to be able to go, I believe it was to like the front office and they would they would put like a little Walt Disney World stamp on the on the postcard for you. They don't apparently do that anymore. But anyway, so I'll be sending those out to you guys from Walt Disney World. So if you do become a patron, you will get a postcard from me every single month. Also check down below for a link to Spreadshirt, where you can grab yourself retro rest stop t-shirts, proceeds, both from Spreadshirt and from Patreon. So you can help putting gas in Banabelle and in pumpkins. So we can come out to interesting places like this and we can try the orange juice. So, all right, guys, like I said, check down below for all the different links. If you guys do hit that like button or you do hit that subscribe button or you are subscribed and I will see you in tomorrow's video. All right, thanks for watching, guys. Have a good one. Bye.